Cattle's new battery. The new battery about to be launched has been said by top executives to take EV battery technology to the next level. What is it about the CL sodium ion battery that has made it gain attention in the EV battery space? For many years, sodium ion batteries have long been pointed to as a safer alternative to the common lithium ion batteries used in many EVs. In contrast to the use of lithium ion batteries, which carry a risk of fire when subjected to damage or force, sodium ion batteries do the opposite. Yes, they offer a more stable and secure energy storage solution for EVs and guarantee safety to a large extent. The potential of CL was highlighted by CL Chief Technology Officer for EV Business, Gawan, during a recent announcement. In his words, he said, Sodium ion battery technology is no longer confined to laboratories. We at CL have made breakthroughs in energy density, cost efficiency, and environmental sustainability, paving the way for mass adoption. This announcement by Gowan opened the way for the release of the CL sodium ion battery technology. Before we continue, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel with the bell notification turned on for more updates. This technology has been announced by several stakeholders at CL to be one of a kind. However, several challenges were left to be overcome before its release. Let's examine that. Those in the EV manufacturing industry would tell you that lithium ion batteries have been the industry's cornerstone since the industry gained acceptance. This is because lithium ion batteries have an impressive energy density. This high energy storage capability per unit volume makes these batteries ideal for applications like electric vehicles and high performance electronics. On the other hand, sodium ion batteries with their inherent lower energy density were not favorites to be used as EV batteries, even when the price of lithium ion batteries dropped. However, fast forward to 2025, and everything that posed a challenge to the adoption of sodium ion batteries over lithium ion batteries has changed, and CL made sure that they took advantage of that. At Supertech Day 2025, CL unveiled its new NXTERA battery platform. The platform offers a major leap in sodium ion battery development and promises to tackle several areas where lithium ion batteries couldn't fill the gap. Now that we've put that aside, let's consider five facts about CL sodium ion batteries, which could lead to the displacement of lithium ion batteries and even disrupt the entire EV industry. The first production under the NX Tira brand will be of a new sodium ion battery with an energy density of 175 watt hours per kilogram. This figure is nearly equivalent to the lithium iron phosphate LFP batteries popularly used in electric vehicles and even surpasses some EV battery energy densities like the BMW i3 and the GI Galaxy E5. On the flip side, this energy density is enough to deliver 124 miles, 200 kilometers, of electric range in a PHEV and up to 310 miles, 500 kilometers, in a pure EV. Those estimates come from China's testing cycle, which is usually pretty generous with range. But those are decent numbers for city cars and micro EVs gaining popularity around the world. Even though lithium ion batteries have stood out because of the energy densities they offer, sodium ion batteries have come to take that spot. In the future, we could even see higher energy densities from sodium ion batteries. You'll agree that lithium ion batteries could become obsolete if this happens. CL says its new sodium ion battery can store a good amount of energy and can charge up to 80% in just 15 minutes at normal room temperature. Even in very cold weather, like minus 20 degrees Celsius, the cells still keep over 90% of their power. To help it function this way, CL has created a system that lets manufacturers combine sodium ion and lithium ion batteries in one unit. The smart control system manages how the two types work together. This helps make up for the fact that sodium ion batteries don't store as much energy while still benefiting from their fast charging and strong performance in cold weather. This solves the cold weather problem for batteries where lithium ion batteries have lacked a solution. Don't you think this could give EVs with sodium ion batteries an edge over lithium ion batteries? This battery is part of CL's broader lineup of sodium ion battery technologies. Based on the current EV technology, we can conclude that CL was just playing it safe when they mentioned the driving range of this new battery. Here's why. Usually energy density indicates how much energy a battery can store per unit of weight. A higher energy density means the battery can store more energy without adding much weight. This is important if a car is to achieve a long driving range. 
For instance, the Tesla Model S long range model, equipped with a 100 kilowatt hour battery, achieves a range of 405 miles, 830 kilometers. Given this efficiency, a vehicle with a 175 watt hours per kilogram battery could potentially achieve a range exceeding 310 miles if we assume similar energy consumption rates. However, we can understand where CL is coming from. They don't want customers to have very high expectations of the batteries. With time, we expect further announcements on this battery specifications. CATL has emphasized that their new sodium ion batteries possess 10,000 life cycles. If this is true, then it is expected that this battery would lead to a breakthrough in battery longevity and reliability. We say this because most current EV batteries last around 1,000 to 2,000 full cycles, which when calculated, translates to eight to 15 years of use. Now, a battery with 10,000 full cycles and 500 kilometers per cycle offers up to 5 million kilometers, 3.1 million miles of driving over its lifetime. Do you know what that means? The battery could outlive the vehicle it is contained in and even outlast multiple vehicles. It would also reduce long-term ownership costs and environmental impact. On the commercial side, it could mean that high mileage services like taxis, delivery vehicles, and buses would benefit enormously. In addition, there would be a lower total cost of ownership due to minimal battery replacement needs. If there's one aspect that is mouthwatering about CL's new sodium ion batteries, then it is the safety it guarantees. The company says its sodium ion battery is much safer because of the way sodium behaves. The battery does not easily form spikes, or what are called dendrites, inside the battery, and it's less likely to overheat or catch fire. CL explained that they tested the battery far more strictly than the usual safety rules require. They even pierced and drilled the fully charged battery, and it barely gave off any smoke, no fire and no explosion. Even cutting the battery with a saw didn't cause it to burn. The reason it's so safe is because of the electrolytes contained in the battery, which act like a protective barrier. They help stop heat from building up and block the formation of dangerous internal structures. The company calls it a kind of built-in firewall, and they made it clear that keeping the battery safe is their top priority. If sodium ion batteries prove to be reliable, automakers may shift towards sodium ion to reduce costs. As you would expect, this would lead to a decline in lithium ion battery demand, as automakers might use sodium ion in lower cost EVs to make those cars more affordable for people. Instead of producing more lithium ion batteries, battery manufacturers might expand to support sodium ion battery production. This could divert capital investment away from further lithium ion innovation, leading to stagnation in its development. Let's have your thoughts in the comment section.